We have a weight and balance problem. Refer to figure 32 and 33. Calculate the weight and balance and determine if the CG and the weight of the airplane are within limits. They provide the weight of the front and rear seat occupants, baggage, and the fuel quantity. We also need the airplane's empty weight, which you'll find on figure 32 right here. I'm going to organize everything into a table. So we have the airplane empty weight. Two thousand and fifteen pounds. Weight, arm, moment. The moment is fifteen fifty four, but the moment notice is in hundreds. So that fifteen fifty four, I'm going to put two zeros at the end to make it one hundred fifty five thousand four hundred. In the front seat. We have front seats, 350 pounds. Rear, 325. Baggage, 27 pounds. And fuel, 35 gallons. Take 35 gallons, multiply by 6 pounds per gallon. I give you the weight of 210 pounds. Now what we need to do is take the weight, multiply it by the arm, and that will give us the moment. So at the front seat, we have 350. On the table, I'm going to go to occupants, front seat. I don't see the weight listed, but I do have the arm of 85 right there. So weight times 85 inches will give us the moment. And you should get 20 9,750. Rear seat, 325. I go to occupants. Rear seat, we do not see the weight there, but we'll use the arm of 121. 121 inches. Multiply those together, and you get 39,325. Baggage, we have 27 pounds. Here's baggage right here. And you'll find the arm is 140. 27 multiplied by 140 gives us 3,780. Fuel, 210 pounds. We go to fuel, main tank. And here we can find 35 gallons. And it has a weight of 210, which is what we have, and a moment in hundreds of 158. But if you use the arm of 75, and you multiply that by 210, you should get 15,750. Now what we need to do is total the weight and the moment. totals down here and the total weight is 2,927 the total moment is 244,005 here's the center of gravity equation CG center of gravity equals the total moment divided by total weight here's the total moment right there divided by the total weight and you should get approximately 83.4 inches. Now what you do is using figure 33, the table on the right, we'll find our weight. And 2,927 is pretty close to 2,930. So that's what we use. And on the table, I can see I have weights right here. And I have a minimum moment and a max. The minimum is your forward center of gravity limit. The max is your aft center of gravity limit. And so 2,930 would be right here. And our moment, which is divided by 100, 
in the table. So we'll take this moment divided by 100. So I'm going to shift that decimal point and put it right here. I can see we have 2440. And our 2440 is between the minimum and the maximum. So we are within limits. And we're wait, our weight is less than 2950. And so we are below the max weight limit. So looking at the answer choices, we have our center of gravity is 83.4, which rules out Alpha and Charlie. And the CG we have confirmed is within limits. Answer Bravo is correct.